Hello and welcome back to our Lugia campaign in Imperator Rome. Still pretty much on the same track as before. We need to make Viadros a chunky big city, although again, I'm I'm not going for mega city here. I'm going for a city with enough citizens to get my technology to not be trash. Like that that's the goal here. It's not to make a mega city. I don't like mega cities. I think they're kind of awful. Uh, what I will do, though, is destroy some of the buildings around here, like this fortress. Waste of money. Th this tribal settlement, not a waste of money. Uh, happiness and output is all really good stuff. Uh, but I get 26 ducats if I delete it, so I'm just going to do it. Um, the farms I'll keep for now, but before I migrate people, I will be destroying them. Just make sure they're all good. It looks like we're good. All right. So, uh, what do you want? Uh, yeah, we'll side with Ascorum. That's probably pronounced perfectly. I'm very good at that. Uh, Invention-wise, is there anything here I really like? I mean, heavy infantry discipline, it's not useful for me right now, but eventually it will be. So I'm going to take it before it becomes too expensive. Uh, one thing I will say, though, is if we look for iron, look at how far we have to go for some iron either into Gaul or all the way down to Masticat. That's, it is a long, long way. Also, um, if we come down here, we're going to have to go for these, sorry, is it these? Yes, it is. These three iron areas here um, are the only <laughs> iron in there. Oh, it's a bit rough, isn't it? It's a little bit rough uh, for iron, so if that comes in handy, it will be a long time. Uh, merge the migration units. This place got 41 pops out of 39. It is, however, still growing population. It, they're not migrating away, so we're, we're still good. Ooh, faith. Uh, yeah, I don't want this one. I want this one. So it's a good job I uh, caught that. There's only a single day left on it. Um, these migrations are still marching around. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. Um, we've got this migration here. Actually, you need to go up there as well. These are still fine. You're still fine. Alright. Uh, go back to the 11th. Oh, no, not you. Uh, the first Lugian migration, which is clearly not the first, but it doesn't matter. We're gonna raise this city. Or, as the comments in my videos have, have liked to say, uh, we are going to go vandalizing places. Negative uh, 142, it's negative 150 that they get super pissed off, so we're not going to do that again. Nor with Aracosia. It's time to go after Mauria. Uh, then, obviously, we've got Gandara. We can do something to. We've got Peruva. And then we're just going to go around looking for all of the cities sacking them and then uh, it's it's gonna be great it's gonna be great it's gonna be good stuff uh, the aggressive expansion is a little bit rough but we are an appeasing stance it's coming down at a sprightly 0.31 a month which is actually you know it's it's actually kind of okay uh, if we check with the if we, if we do a bit of an arumba a second and bring the calculator out uh, 0.31 a month times 12 is 3.72. Um, per year. If we do uh, 59 divided by 3.72, we're looking at about 15 years to get down to zero at its current pace, uh, but it's actually going to go and take a lot longer than that, unfortunately. So we're going to go down here, then we're going to head up to the Seleucid Revolt. Hell yeah! We'll sack some Seleucid Revolters. And do that a couple of times. It doesn't matter about being at war with them. Alright. Vandalize that city. I'm totally embracing that, by the way. Uh, we need to find a city up here. We could probably just force march everywhere. See no reason not to. Let's go to Madra. Then we're going to go up here. We're going to go here. Then turn around. Uh, Nabaka. Probably another Mauria. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. Uh, is there anything for lowering um, aggressive expansion, actually? Because that would be really handy. 
Primaculture happiness is decent enough. Pop conversion speed would be quite nice, actually. And that is a passive effect. I do like that. Um, but as for aggressive expansion change, we'd have to go to Perkunus, uh, which we're totally going to do. We're going to Perkunus, and for now, we're going to go with some tribes and output. Did tank our uh, stability just a little bit, but we'll, uh, we'll have to deal with it. Vandal Slave is killed. I don't like that. Uh, this uh, Adric could be useful. That's the one I usually go with. Because it's, it's good. It's, it's just good stuff. Alright. I would like to start migrating some more people. So, let's start here. You need to... Be, of course, you need to be Vandal first. Very little of this area is Vandal yet. Uh, this needs cultural assimilation. This here is still on the religious thing. You're still on the religious thing. Oh, it's going to take so long. As for missions, the matter of Germania, we're looking at this area. That is a lot of claims. And we do want to go that way, but I think we're going to go with growth. Unfulfilled potential. Apparently, never mind. Matter of Germania is, half, is going to have to be the one. I'll do it for the claims, because eventually we do want to kill all of this. Um, but we want our tech to be somewhat decent first. Um, as for... I mean, we're losing how much? 0.25 centralization a month. If we were to get rid of some of these, that might be a good idea. I like the stability. I definitely like the assimilation. Oh yeah, war philosophy. We want to go to morale of armies. Um, over here, I'm thinking some civilization change. And that's that's all we're going to do for now. We're at 12 stability. Uh, let's, uh, let's sacrifice the gods. We'll get rid of some of that. Alright, so you are not able to raise this because... We're force marching. We raise this city. Da, 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 da. We can raise you twice. Because it honestly doesn't matter if they get pissed off at us and declare war on us. Because they're not going to exist forever. Let's actually go to Gandhara first and then come back into this area. That is a sexy looking flag. I much prefer that to the Seleucid's actual flag. That's really nice. Alright, let's get to the city. Uh, you like us uh, negative 62, so we can raise happily enough. Then we're going to go to Taxila. That's going to cause us to be at war with these guys. But again, it, it doesn't matter. Two slaves become freemen? Sure. Raise you. That's war. That's fine. And we're going to get... Oh, no, we got caught by this fort. I didn't see it. No, no. Oh, tits. I can go here. That gets me caught by the fort again, though. Shite. And I don't have enough troops. Well, piss on my ass. Well, that, that's another 3k just down the drain, because cause why not? God damn it. Lambert, you fucking fool. Um, I think I can probably do this just fine. Start civilizing a little bit in Viadras. Clan Council speaks. Uh, we've got a bit more... A uh, few claims. It's, it's a nice amount of claims. Interestingly, it gave me claims here and here, but not in the middle, which is, uh, I mean, it's interesting, isn't it? It's just, it's interesting. Lack of food for you, naturally. And if I press the retreat button, it's gonna bring me to the fort. Ah, tits. That is uh, quite the arse. 
Oh, we're at war with this guy as well. Naturally. Sure. I can't even go to this fort. I'm going to go back to Texila. Ah, that's not good. That is not good. Hey, Seleucids, do you want a peace deal? <laughs> Suggestions. All of my land, apart from one territory, becomes a part of the Seleucid Revolt, which would then be subsumed by the Seleucid Empire. Ugh. This is really quite annoying. I mean, I could fuck them up by, like, desecrating the holy sites, but the Seleucid Revolt and the Seleucids obviously aren't Hindu, so it, it actually doesn't help us at all. Hopefully the Seleucids come over and, and siege that, or win their war, and I'll uh, just stop being at war. Yeah, but I fucked up again. This It's just uh, it's just something that happened. Unfortunately, that means that my aggressive expansion change goes down way slower now, which is obviously not good. Yeah, if this civilizes more, there's going to be a higher pop cap. I don't know how many pops I really want to be here. Actually, you know what we could do? Nothing, because we can't build aqueducts, naturally. Okay, good job. <laughs> okay, what do we want, though? We could build a foundry for some population output. It's it's only 1%. Or I could build another academy. Okay, there's there's the army dead. Fine. Build another academy. Actually, you know what? No. Let's build another library. I want to get this uh, citizen ratio up a bit more. Uh, money or stability? In this case, I'll go with stability. We really do need to start migrating more people. And this is kind of the area I want to migrate first. Oh, but they're all the wrong culture. Religion is changing, though, which is nice. Over here, I mean, I guess what I could do here is just settle some pops. I need to settle five pops in Venedicana, and then that's and that's happy again. You know what? I'm going to do that. Let's go settle five pops in uh, Venedicana. It's in my home state as well, so it shouldn't be too bad. It's a, it's a decent idea. Can't be argued with. Got the space for it. It's just, it's just good stuff. Might want to make another city. I don't know yet. Uh, don't want to raise levies. We want to settle. And now this area is equal culture, but the religion is certainly on our side. The faith of Baldagast. I'll take the stability. Thank you. Can I have some more of that, please? Those faith ones are great. So. If I swapped you out for Twomwald, we'd have a little bit more aggressive expansion modifier. You are not very loyal, in fairness. And you're also trying to assassinate someone that I don't care about. We'll probably leave you alone. Oh, come on, just change culture. I don't want to bribe you, but 10 loyalty on three characters... That's worth 42 ducats, let's be fair. That's definitely worth 42 ducats. Bastarnia still exists, and look at Catinia just absolutely getting destroyed. What I could do is just migrate my entire population, sack Rome a couple of times, siege it, <laughs> job done. A new high priest is needed, we'll go with Akdamar Tuomi. Sounds decent. It's a good idea. Law-wise, I mean, we could keep honor in battle, get rid of all of these, and start going down the economic system. I believe it is possible to get every single one of these. I've never done it, but I've been assured that it's actually possible. Ooh, yes, look at that. You'll get, you're not as good as this guy, but five out of five, uh, you know, martial statesmanship stuff. Um, I mean, it, it's actually irrelevant, because who cares about cohort recruit speed? But at the same time, like, that's a pretty damn good amount of statesmanship. 
Right, stability is pretty good. Is there anywhere here that I can now convert or tr migrate, I guess, is the word? Uh, I don't think I can migrate any of these people. We could start migrating this, perhaps? Is there anywhere here? Nope. It is mostly Chewistic. There's only one settlement here that needs more of my own kind of hops. We'll get it eventually. There's a minor addendum. Six stability sounds lovely. I'll take it. We might send another 3k. Get them to go maybe to Carthage. Croton's looking quite tasty. Actually, if we do that, you're going to declare war, so maybe not. Uh, you don't have any spare cities. You don't have any spare cities. Rome hates us at negative 200, so that's not going to happen. Uh, negative 114, too much. No spare cities. We haven't headed down to Greece in a while. Negative 200, that's never going to happen. Negative 200, negative 176, negative 200. Sparta, we could do Sparta. Let's head down to Mesen, and then we can head to Athens. We can probably do Chalcis, no we can't, because that's Phrygia. All right, so we can do two cities here. You're defended. You're all defended. <laughs> we could even colonize in uh, in Greece. Nice. Bob, no. Die, asshole. Thanks for the money. Uh, let's go with aggressive expansion change from Perkunas. Um, so, I mean, we could go down to Egypt, we haven't done them yet, or Judea, there's a couple of undefended cities that we could raid. Um, the Phoenicians are all defended, we've got white peace with the Seleucid Revolt, very nice. I imagine you hate me, but not enough. Alright, so we're going to get you. Uh, you're about to get a civil war, so we can do your civil war. 5,000 manpower, I mean... I'm at my max already, so I'll take the political influence. Thank you. Speaking of political influence, let's get another provincial procurator. Uh, you want some amber? Sure. There's more barbarians. 10,000 of them. Maybe my own army is going to have to deal with that. Mate, 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 mate. Fuck all the way off. We're being flanked a little bit. Jeez, he had heavy infantry as well. Where the shit did he come from? It'd be nice if they said barbarians of and wherever they're from, you know. Anyway, cross a river into me and you're all dead. Very nice. Go back to my own place. He gave me nothing. He gave me one pop that will be distributed somehow. Cool. Uh, become friend. Oh, my bodyguard has become friends with the general. Uh, I'm sure it's going to be fine. It's it's going to be it's going to be perfectly fucking awesomely fine. No worries. I'm not worried at all. Sparta should be because Masen's about to get raided. The Mamertine Republic. Do you hate me? You do not hate me. Do you have any undefended cities? You do, but it'd be a case of coming down here, city, and then back up again. Macedon and Phrygia's borders are just fucking filth, let's be fair. Let's be quite honest about this. Can I... No, can't. I don't want to go to war with, uh, with Macedon. With you, I can do it once only. I mean, hopefully this is going to be a good idea. I mean, you're at six martial advances. It's it's probably fine. 
Let's also check, right? So you've got 15 pops, you've got 32. If I was to raise here 3.41, and if I'm to raise here, it is 3.56, so it does make a difference. And it might be actually the civilization value. I think it's probably the civilization value. Anyway, let's raise that. Lovely. And we wanted to go for Athens as well. Athens only at negative 58. Yeah, if I was to do it to you, we'd go to war. Bit of a bountiful harvest. I'll take the stability. Alright, raise the city. Lovely. Right. Can we go for any of you? No, you're all defended well enough. You're defended. All that's defended. Armenia, we can probably get you again. Negative 117, probably not actually. But you are about to have... Or you were about to have a rebellion. Alright, never mind. We're going to Cappadocia instead. It's actually civilization map mode. It's all looking fairly ubiquitous. It's it's pretty much the same across the board. 49-ish. Oh, maybe not 49-ish across the board. But you've got a 4901. This one is 4619. You're 4901. You're 4903. You're the best so far. God damn it, this fucking tooltip is huge. Uh, you are 45, you're trash. Alright, well, we're going to go for that 4903. Then get out of that map mode, because it's giving me a headache. Look at that Treveria, man, that's huge. Hopefully Treveria and Rome have a big fight, and then Rome ends up going all the way up here. That'd be funny. Uh, I have a new son. He's called Wildegast. Uh, I'm sure that's a solid name. It looks like we've got a new retinue as well. Maybe. Oh yeah, you could probably also uh, do a bit of drilling as well, right? Yeah, you can. Considering it's free, no reason not to. Because this will be going... I mean, the average cohort experience, does it count these guys? Hopefully. A uh, bit of co pop conversion speed, obviously going to take that, for sure. Let's have a look. Religion still spreading slowly. Uh, I can start migrating some of these guys, though. I lost myself my salt. Great. So you can't be done, and you can't be done. But I think I'm going to settle these guys. It's only stability, after all. So we need, like, five or six dudes. You go there, you go there. We'll just we'll just do the entire thing. It means very little. Uh, so I could put everyone to death from fugitives... Ah, oh, fugitives across the border. Okay. I mean, yeah, I'll, I'll get a few dudes. It's whatever. And you can settle as well. Then we're going to migrate. I guess we're going to wait a month, and then we're going to migrate? Chewistic Vandal. Yeah, they are the... The most. There we go. We just need to wait a month. So there's a few more pops. I could just settle them all over here. Like, I'm going to migrate all of these guys anyway. So I don't see why not. Like, what is the reason we wouldn't want to do this? I think I need five pops only here. So we'll split you in half. The five is going to go there. Here, we're going to need seven pops. So split you in half, and the seven can go there. Over here, we're probably going to just, just you go there. This is the fastest way to culturally convert someplace. Uh, that six can go down here. Uh, we got another six. Uh, we need somewhere with five pops, I think, for that to work out best. You can go there. You want to probably go around here somewhere. Got an unused trade route. Probably because I lost my salt import. Oh, that was my pop cap. Tits. We'll get some furs. So the pop cap here has now gone down to 38. Rough. Very rough. Alright, you settle, you settle, you settle, you settle. As soon as you arrive here, you're going to also settle. 
I'm gonna wait a month. And then if you can migrate now, you should... Oh, fuck off. At least you can migrate. Same with you. Same with you. Uh, you can migrate. Very nice. So you just literally need a pop. You're going to need nine pops. Is it this one? Yeah. You're going to need nine pops. You're going to need fucking seven pops. There's six, and there's another one. You're gonna need six pops. No, you're not. You're gonna need five pops. Good job, I got five pops right here. If you settle, you can be done next month. You settle, you group and settle, and then you can settle. Wait a month. I was caught red handed. Uh, that's fine. There's some more migrations happening. Very nice. As long as you don't go over 20, it's totally fine to do this. Because 20 is the max amount that you can uh, pull up in one go. Alright, so you need 7, probably. No, you don't. You only need 6. So I'll take the 6. You can go there. Over here, we're looking at 7 pops needed. Good job, really. Uh, over here, we're probably looking at six pops. Then here, we're looking at literally one pop. Fuck it, these four can go. As long as it go doesn't go over 20, it's totally fine. So, settle and settle. Settle. And another settle, then wait a month, you and you and you and you, pretty sure there's a building that I forgot to get rid of, but yeah, there is a bunch more, another 117 pops moved, very nice. So we could get them all to go here and, uh, you know, pull up the entire population. But, of course, we're going to let stability go up first. A uh, bit of wrong culture happiness is going to come in very handy. And also, we've sorted out our cultural unity. Now there's only four Eastian matrists. Or five there. I imagine they're probably all going to be in the capital. Yeah, it looks like it. There's no assimilation or... Actually, no, they're not in the capital. All right, well, where are they then? They're all in Venedicana. Well, you know what we could probably do is, is just is real quick, just real fucking swiftly, um, fix that by making them all my culture and religion. <laughs> yeah, that's... I mean, it did make them all tribesmen, which I guess can be a positive or a negative. Um... But hey, they're all my culture now. Uh, we're also going to get rid of everyone but horses. I mean, they're all horses, but we want to keep the light horse. All right. And what I'm also going to do is put a small cut in here. It's been another long episode, so apologies, and you're welcome for that. I uh, hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you did, feel free to click the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next episode, where... More migration goodness and more, more, more sacking, probably. Probably going to be another war as I fuck it up again. Uh, but yeah, things are going pretty well. I'm happy. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.